What's that? That's another Volkswagen Rabbit. You know I'm, what's terrifying hold on, hold to me? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, it's a race car. This right here is going to be my Miata drivetrain Rabbit. <laughs> Out of that Miata. If only you guys could have the glasses that Scotto has on right now of seeing the potential in all these instead of what it's That's going to be an all-wheel drive Haldex R32 Rabbit. Oh, That's okay. different. Okay. So today we have a car that uh, I'm pretty stoked about. It is a Volkswagen very rear wheel drive using one of our favorite platforms here, the base of Shark Cart and things Dan likes. Miata. My Miata! So is this a Miata wheelbase? Three inches longer. Okay. A track right. width is the same, wheelbase is three inches longer. Okay. From the front frame rails to the back of the seats, it's all the Miata floor cam. And then it's boxed in uh, to the rear subframe. So did you essentially drop a Miata rear subframe and then just build it to fit in the back of this? I personally did. So who now, built this one? Uh, his name was John. He's up in NorCal. Okay. I got this through a friend because my buddy actually bought his other truck which is another rabbit truck. Is this Bad Habit Rabbit? Because I think I've seen this thing doing donuts before. Yeah. The ladder rack is extremely, is a big giveaway. Because if you look at it, it is a structural ladder rack. It is a structural ladder rack. It's, it's basically the roll cage of the car and what holds the chassis together. Yeah. But it's also can carry ladders. I mean, this is basically like what rail car aspires to be. So, is it though? <laughs> just is the it ladder though? rack part. Rail you know, car just aspires anymore. to be something that moves. <laughs> What's under the hood? Is it still Miata powered? It's still Miata powered. It's the stock 1.8 on stock, making all the 150 maybe horsepower. What year, what what year Miata? Can we, hold on, can we just Yo, talk about real quick? That's actually, uh, that, uh uh. It's designed, because look, it goes through. I know, I know. The it's the grill and then out. This isn't an afterthought. What year Miata motor? 94, okay. if I remember correctly. Yo, it looks like it belongs in there. It's right at home. You even got mad space in front so of the radio. So this, yeah. is, this is all Miata. So yeah. you've cut out the strut towers and everything out of the rabbit and basically just grafted the rabbit or caddy body onto the Miata. Like this is what shark cart would look like if we put a, if we put body, a body on it. That's sick. Uh, that's what I've been wanting to do. Uh, that's what I, that's oh, how we, shit. that's what I started saying. Let's cut one of those bad boys up. This was the idea. <laughs> We troll each other so hard that there nothing is real anymore. No, I actually we, thought there, you wanted no to do that. It sounded like a good plan. We I need that of, thing in like the that. Matrix where they, what was that thing that Neo did to know if he was in the Matrix or not? What? I think you're thinking of Inception. You yeah. need the totem. Spin and spin. What do you do with this thing? Uh, it's a true built purpose of being a drift missile. Yeah? Yeah. All right. I've had it out at uh, Apple Valley Speedway a couple times. Oh, okay. oh yeah. And How's it do? Okay. Thanks guys. Wait, is that rail car underneath? Actually, I think it was your Evo engine, oh, but whatever. Oh, God, no. Joke's on you, that's not built yet. Lancer motor, my problem. Pain! So it's independent rear suspension, because it's uh, that's out of the Miata. Yeah. It's now a longitudinal setup, five-speed trans. I mean, this is like so this everything you need to make a rabbit cool. It's all Miata, right? Yeah. yeah. Like, this is the whole floor is Miata. This is still rabbit. All right, I recognize yeah. that. But it looks like they basically just cut pretty much right below that, like, cross support and then just made the bottom of it Miata. That's the, pretty sick. The more I look at it, the more I love it. I love your ammo box, glove box. It, nice it's little touch. really handy. I'm yeah. not gonna lie, it's really handy to have that, especially when it rains. I like this OEM door pull on the delete panel. That's yeah, nice. that's nice. Nice touch. Do you watch our content? Okay, because I was gonna say this looks like something we built, <laughs> and unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, it's a backhanded compliment. <laughs> I think we skipped ahead. Let's run through this from the front. So engine, just stock 1.8, right? Stock 1.8. Which is a great motor. We had a stock 1.8 in shark cart for a really long time. It'll take a beating. Yeah. Stock me out of transmission. Stock me out of five speed, yeah. Which we've proven. Really good at shifting hurt, first to Almost first. hurt proof. Uh, what suspension are you on? Stock Miata uh, with some eBay coil. Oil. I was gonna say those nice, look like yeah. Max Peating. I was gonna say that yeah. gold is a very a Max touch, Peating a, a color right peaks. there. Uh, my whole thing with this was to learn. Drift on it, hell yeah! Because uh, it's a beater. It's 
not the nicest looking car on as the one. Whoa, 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 whoa. It can hear you. There's definitely purists that are bummed right now that this doesn't have like a 1.6 liter diesel in it. I mean, the body's pretty straight. It's got some patina and stuff, but it's not like you've smashed it into any walls yet. Not yet. They're still today. Here, yeah. I hate Indeed, to say right. this, but this looks cooler than Shark Cart to me. It's 100% true. I mean, the Shark Shark Cart looks like a go-kart. Yeah. This looks like a car. So comment below if you think Shark Cart should get a body. Better body than these, but... Ball like ballast that. boy bodies? Oh, yeah. So let me ask you something. You don't have to answer if you don't want, but what does the DMV think this is? The DMV thinks this is a diesel rabbit. Nice. No smog, baby. You just snitched on him, by the way. So. We Get wait for the letter from the EPA. Alerts, the alerts the right out. Find me. Well, sick, man. Yeah, Unless you got anything else to share. You know what I like? This guy's got a Miata engine in this thing. And he did everyone the service of putting a muffler on it. Because, <laughs> like, if you got a straight-piped four-cylinder, you're just, you're hurting everyone. Yeah. Give us a little blip. She's quiet. Just sounds like SCCA. Yeah. <laughs> that line, bro. Show me the Pelotis. <laughs> Will this do just, like, good sitting burnouts, too? Try it. Drive train slap. Coolant gauge oh, accurate? I think so. The gas gauge isn't. A little overheating. I think that's uh, dirt. Beat the rush. That dirt. was water going in, not coolant. Vin, you're a parking lot master. Ex Volkswagen kid, you have plenty of seat time in Shark Cart. Let's I'm get a little close. review I'm going. Down. I'm down. Let me know when she's ready to go again. She stopped pissing, so it means that you can drive her now, I think. This is max that, seat. That no, let me get in there. Let, let, let you see you complain. No, because I'm not getting, you can get in after All me right. because getting in and out was too hard. <laughs> Wasn't making that noise before. It was. Sure? <laughs> not not here. It was. Okay. That's the most that's the most oil pressure it's ever had. Yeah. All right. <laughs> hey, as long, as, long as you know. I gotta get a little familiar with it first.
he's asking you to tap right there. I don't know the length of it yet. You got, you, from the last slide, you were about five feet away. Yeah, I know. Start bringing it in. What was that? Diff. Yeah. Oh, I think it's diff. Oh. It's something pro dead. It's only partially connected. Dang. You know, you put the ballast boys in. You're it's definitely Ron's out. fault for being yeah, in. Too much time. Yeah, honestly, you had to go full hog like that. You, you could just go in there. <laughs> it could have just let Vinny do it. I had it. a wing stop last night. Sorry, Vinny broke your car. It's all right. I just did a donut in it. So he broke it. I just was there when it broke. That sounds real hurt. He pre-broke it. He did. He did. He's he's accusing him of pre-breaking it before Vinny got in. Yeah. What do you guys think of this thing? This is the raddest yeah. roll cage I've ever seen in my life. It's pretty <laughs> sick, right? Yeah. yeah. The it's, most it's the most functional one I've it's, ever yeah, seen for like sure. You need some sunscreen though. To go in with a 42.0 just because car is pretty underwhelming power wise but he he handled it well and it's fun to watch i'm gonna go in with a 45.88 still got a little bit of seat time to have in the car but he did get close to the container he got close to the wall he did not let off throttle for like a good five minutes so yeah 45. he learned to drive it i think while driving it in the yard because you could see he just got better and better and better plus it's a cool build that i would want to build so I'm gonna give him a 46. I'm usually the low judge. You can see my bias here. A solid 59. Whoa, whoa. That's good, right? <laughs> you know, it's a cool build, and he was really kicking the shit out of it around the yard, right? I'm gonna give him 45. I'm going with 69. No. I killed it out here. All right. This is the most unique thing that's ever been in this yard. Your car oh, was in this yard. Hold it on Damn here, hard this. like this. No, just sit on the, sit on the tailgate. Just like that, yeah. Scrape your butthole on the wall. <laughs> you I'm are good. The, I'm, yeah. good. I'm good. You are the proximity. <laughs> I'll let you know. You could ride in the back and just brace yourself. I think I could, huh? 